Hey guys, welcome new friends, and thank you to all of my new subscribers. You guys are all now my new friends here on YouTube. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos. And if you're watching this, don't forget to subscribe. So last night I was on YouTube, and I was watching one of my favorite makeup artists, Makeup by Ren Ren. Definitely go and check her channel out. She has some very beautiful looks. And she did a look with blues. Blue is also one of my favorite colors to use. And so I thought I would do a um, untraditional look for around this time of the year. And I hope you guys like it, all right? So I already started on this eye. Hope you guys can see here. And we're going to go ahead and do this eye, all right? So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a layer of translucent powder. Powder. This is um, the yellow powder by Bobbi Brown. And I'm just going to apply it underneath my eye here. This will help any fallout that may come from the shadow. Then I'm going to take the Zoe K Brow Quad. That can be found at my site. The link will be posted right over there in the subscriber box. Here it is. I'm going to take the brown and just fill in the brow using short light strokes just trace your brow the way that it naturally goes grows in and if you want to know more about um, how to do this the technique. Um, I do have another brow video, so just check it out on my channel. Alright, so just fill it in. And then I'm going to be using mainly the, um, the 88 Matte Palette. This can also be purchased at my site. It has a lot of beautiful colors. It's been the most popular thing on my site. A lot of people really like the colors that are available in this palette. So I'm going to start off using this um, light color here. Put that one all over. You know what? I just realized that I didn't put the primer on. So I'm going to go back a step. This is the eye and lip primer. And you just put a thin layer on. Actually, I put it on all over on the other eye, but I forgot, so it's okay. Okay, so just put it on all over. Go back. I'm going to go back to the light shade here. See how it makes the color just really pop out and um, it makes the color just really um, adhere to your eyelid. So I really recommend this, this primer. Okay. So put the primer on all over. And then I'm going to take this gold shade here. And I'm going to put that on the inside. Just the inside corner of the lid. Then I'm going to take this blue here. And put that in the center. Hope you guys can see. Then I'm going to take the darkest blue here and put that on the outer corner. And the colors that Ren Ren, Makeup by Ren Ren used um, were by MAC, so I'm giving you a different option, a, a, um, a cheaper option. Um, as you guys know, sometimes the eyeshadows, I don't know how much the eyeshadows are running at MAC now, but this would definitely be a cheaper route for you.
So just put all three shades on like that. Then I'm going to take a little bit of the NYX glitter. Oh man, I took the... Shoot, I can't tell you guys what color this one is. I don't... I lost the, um, the thing, but... It's like, um... It's like a teal color. I'm just going to take a little bit of this. I have to find one of those storage videos on YouTube for these glitters because I, um, they can be a little messy. So I'm just going to put that in the center. You guys know I don't usually do dramatic looks because I don't hardly ever wear dramatic makeup. I like it. It's so pretty. But, um, it's not realistic for my lifestyle. But I saw that, and I saw I saw that look by Ren, makeup by Ren Ren, and I said, I gotta try that. The blue she had were so pretty. So I'm gonna take, um, a piece of tape here. <coughs> Put it on the outside, and I'm doing this so that I can get a really nice, fine angle. This tape don't want to stick. So that I can get a really nice, fine angle like this side here. And I'm going to take this dark blue. And I'm just going to put that one on the outer corner there. Going to blend it. Okay. Then I'm going to take that same color blue and apply it underneath the eye. Kind of like in a, oh goodness, in a V shape. And I'm going to be doing trying out different colors that you guys want me to try this week. So just send me a request, either here on YouTube or my Facebook fan page, and whatever colors you guys send in, that's what I'll do this week for you guys. Well, I'll select, I'll select the most interesting. So uh, another request that I got was how to use bronzer and blush. So this is for you, Erica. This is Global Warming. This is by Interface. And you see it has a bunch of different shades. I'm just going to take my blush brush. And the way that you want to use your bronzer is apply it underneath the cheekbone. Or like around the temples here. And then I always like to, like to use shadows as um, blush. So, oh, look at my palette. It's all, I got to clean it off. So I'm going to use this pink eyeshadow, this one here. It's like a baby pink. It's really, really light. I hope you guys can see it. And I'm going to use that as my pop of color on my cheek. Then I'm going to...